Hello friends, welcome to automation community. Today in this video, we are going to discuss about a timer known as TP. Time pulse is used to keep the output on for a defined duration of time. A timer starts when it receives an input signal and produced an output signal for defined time period before resetting itself. It means when input is on, the output should remain on for a certain period of time. For example, we want when we turn on the input, the output should remain on for 5 seconds or the output should remain on for 1 hour. So in this case, we use timer known as TP, time pulse. So let's move to EcoStructure Machine Expert where we will draw a ladder diagram as and use this timer time pulse. I will open EcoStructure Machine Expert Basic. I will keep read protection as inactive and write protection as inactive and then click on apply. Then I will go to configuration tab. Here is a list of different logic controllers. I will be using TN221C24R. I will click on it and drag it to here. Do you want to replace? You may lose some features and associated configuration. I will click on yes. So here is the device description. It has 14 digital inputs, 10 relay outputs, 2 analog inputs, 1 serial line port, and 100 to 240 volt AC power supply controller with removable thermal blocks. Then I can also go to serial line where I will select protocol as TMS 2GDB and then click on apply. Then I'll go to programming tab. So here I will be drawing ladder diagram and I will use a timer known as TP, time pulse. I can also click on this option for a full screen mode and then zoom into it like this. So I will insert one normally open contact, one coil here. I will assign address to the contact as I 0.0. .0. I will also add symbol rate as input 0. Yes. Input 0. Yes. And then I will assign address to the coil as Q 0.0. .0. I will also add symbol rate as output 0. Yes. So when input 0 is on, output 0 will be on. And then when input 0 is off, the output 0 will be on. So in case we want that when input 0 is on, output 0 should remain on for a certain period of time. And then automatically it should be turned off. So for this, we will use a timer known as TP, that is time pulse. So I will click on this option function blocks and then I will select timers and then select it here. So I will select it as TP, time pulse. And then I will select time base as one second and preset value as 10. And then click on apply. So when our input 0 will be on, output 0 will be on for 10 seconds. And after that, it will automatically be turned off even if input 0 is on. So I will exit full screen mode and then I will compile the program. And then I will go to commissioning and launch simulator.
and then I will start controller. To do so, click OK. Then I will go to programming and full screen mode. So when I turn on input 0, output 0 will be on for 10 seconds. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 and the output 0 will be off. So I will exit full screen mode. I will go to commissioning and stop simulator. And then go to programming and full screen mode. And then I will add a new rung here. And then I will insert one normally open contact, coil, and a timer here. So I will assign address to this contact, same as input 0, that is i 0, 0.0, and then q 0.1. I will add symbol to it as output. One. Yes. <clears throat> so here I will select it as TP time pulse and select time base as one second and preset value as 20 and then click on apply. So here when input 0 is on, output 0 will remain on for 10 seconds and output 1 will remain on for 20 seconds and after that even if input 0 is on the outputs will be off so i will exit full screen mode i will compile the program <clears throat> and then go to commissioning and launch simulator and then start controller to do so click ok so i will go to programming and full screen mode so when i turn on i 0, 0.0 that is input 0 so output 0 will remain on for 10 seconds 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 and after that output 0 will be off and then 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. And then output 1 will be off. It was all about this video. Thank you for watching.